statistical process control. We all know that the concept of TQM is basically very simple. Each part of the organization has customers, some external and many internal. In this lesson, we will discuss statistical process control, statistical quality control and process capability. After going through this presentation, you should be able to discuss statistical process control. Describe statistical quality control. Understand company-wide quality. Explain process capability. Statistical process control, SPC, can be thought of as the application of statistical methods for the purposes of quality control and improvement. Quality improvement is perhaps foremost among all areas in business for application of statistical methods. Statistical process control SPC involves using statistical techniques to measure and analyze the variation in processes. SPC is used to monitor the consistency of processes used to manufacture a product as designed. It aims to get and keep processes under control. No matter how good or bad the design, SPC can ensure that the product is being manufactured as designed and intended. A primary tool used for SPC is the control chart, a graphical representation of certain descriptive statistics for specific quantitative measurements of the manufacturing process. It provides the methods and tools for the manufacturing manager to improve quality, increase productivity and enhance the competitive position of the manufacturing line. Statistical quality control provides the statistical techniques necessary to assure and improve the quality of products. Most of the statistical quality techniques used now have been developed during the last century. CWQC is a system of activities to assure that quality products and services required by customers are economically designed, reduced and supplied while respecting the principle of customer orientation and the overall public well-being. These quality assurance activities involve market research, research and development, design, purchasing, production, inspection and sales, as well as other related activities inside and outside the company. The term control in Japanese implies management and hence Japanese quality control really means quality management. In the Western world, we have a different perception of the term quality control. The framework looks specifically at the role and effectiveness of the senior management team. The capability of a process is the fraction of output that can be routinely found to be within specifications. Process capability is the range over which the natural variation of a process occurs as determined by the system of common or random causes. That is, process capability indicates what the process can deliver under stable conditions when it is said to be under statistical control. Process capability is a range of natural variability in a process, what we measure with control charts. Go through the example. CP equals to 0 0.703. Since this is less than 1, the process is not regarded as being capable. CR equals to 142.2% implies that the natural tolerance consumes 142% of the specifications. This is not a good situation at all. CM equals to 0 0.527. Being less than 1.33, this implies that if we are dealing with a machine, that would be incapable of meeting requirements. ZL equals to 1.9. This should be at least plus 3 and this value indicates that approximately 2.9% of the product will be undersized. ZU equals 2.3. It should be at least plus 3 and this value indicates that approximately 1.1% of the product will be oversized. 
CPK equals to 0 0.63. Since this is only slightly less than the value of CP, the indication is that there is little to be gained by centering and that the need is to reduce process variation. Now let us check if we have understood the various concepts discussed in this lesson clearly. Statistical process control includes innovative thinking to prevent defects. Right or wrong? Wrong. Statistical process control SPC is a process to control the variability of output using control charts. Right or wrong? Right. Process capability is the range over which the natural variation of a process occurs and is determined by the system of common random causes. Right or wrong? Right. Before we end, let us briefly revise what we have studied so far. Statistical process control, SPC, is a process to control the variability of output using control charts. Design of experiments is an application of statistical methods for producing high quality, robust products and process designs. On a control chart, a certain characteristics of the product is plotted. Under normal conditions, these plotted points are expected to vary in a usual way on the chart. SPC also monitors processes, capability and indicator of the adequacy of the manufacturing process to meet customer requirements under routine operating conditions. In summary, SPC aims at maintaining a stable, capable and predictable process. It uses statistical methods to improve or enhance quality for customer satisfaction. It involves monitoring a process to identify the unique causes of variation for signaling appropriate corrective actions. Process capability is the range over which the natural variation of a process occurs and is determined by the system of common or random causes.